what is antenna guy? Uh, antenna pad pattern. Antenna does not radiate equally in all directions. So if you just draw a symbol of an antenna, of course it doesn't do what's known as isotropic. In other words, all its energy just spreads out in all directions. What antenna does always is it radiates somewhat more in one direction than it does in an, another direction and one draws this in the form of a pattern. So if you've got a directional antenna, and this is just a drawing of an antenna that fires in that direction, you will get a pattern that will look perhaps like this. And this is just a cut through. This pattern actually is like a big sausage if you view it in space. It's a three dimensional pattern. This is what they would call an azimuth cut if this is along the earth. So in other words, if you've got people standing around here and this is the surface of the earth, this would be an azimuth cut. And what this indicates is that most of it will be um, radiated in this direction, somewhat less towards the sides. These things here we call side lobes and this we call a back lobe. So if you cut it in that way, you must probably get a similar type of thing with slightly different side lobes. Back lobe and front will always be the same because they actually cut here, cut here, so they're the same point. If we now look at omni antennas, what's known as omni, if you look at a small omni, it's actually got a pattern which typically is a fat bubble this way and a fat bubble this way when you cut it through from the top. So this is a side view and what it actually is is a donut. In other words, it, if you look at it from the top, if you look at the same thing from the top, it radiates equally well in azimuth. Okay, That's why it's called omnidirectional, but you can see that doesn't mean it radiates in all directions. And then I've this a little bit like a big balloon, this guy, that you squash and then you get some radiation going more in another direction. This one you squash from the top and bottom. And if you then get high gain omnis, they typically longer, that's why I'm drawing like that, then all you're doing is you're squeezing these parts, you know, where it's a little bit wasted to the sky and to the ground, you're squeezing them a little bit harder and then these points go a little bit further than here and it radiates better but it radiates now over a smaller angle so this thing must be upright that one can be a little skewed and you're going to get the same sort of pattern